This dog is sedated with Domitol plus Ketamine IV, Domitol 0.1, Ketamine 0.15. Normally the duration is about 10 minutes where you can irrigate the ears. Now you can see the left ear is definitely inflamed. Something might have dropped in during the Christmas period last week because he likes to go under the Christmas tree and uh, this left ear is very itchy and uh, so we pluck the hairs first okay finish then we pluck the other side also you can see it's really inflamed huh? we'll slowly turn over now this side actually is clean there yeah? it's not inflamed okay come this side uh, we exchange sides to uh, pluck the hairs now you see it's very white huh? Actually, there is no inflammation, but we do both ears at the same time to clear the wax as well. Now you can see the dog is not really 100% down. This is just a sedation, huh? and uh, the tongue is okay now. It was a bit pale early on. Now there is a bit of tartar, so. But other than that, the teeth is the gums are alright. Tartar in the premolar four. That is the premolar four. A little bit of tartar. The canines are okay. Now this one is a. The jaws are not uh, aligned properly. The lower jaw is longer. In the Shih Tzu. In this Shih Tzu. Yeah. That is the, the characteristic of this, this breed. Normally the, the upper jaw should be a bit forward. Just in front of the lower jaw, the teeth should be. This teeth should be in front of the lower jaw, the teeth. Huh? And it's called scissors bite. Scissors bite is the normal positioning of the upper, upper and lower jaws. Okay, so this one is called uh, overshot lower jaw. Okay, ready? We we'll start. Do do the, do the other side first before he wakes up. Okay, you take the you take over this camera. Yeah. I just could give a quick one. No, you take, oh, that's you stay that side. We we'll do. Huh? Oh, stay this side. Okay. Now keep this first. Okay. Now. You can see actually there is some ear wax as well there, you see? Okay, so normally I do 45 degrees. 45, huh? Then massage. Now without sedation, it's very difficult to do. Uh, now I'll try to get this up a bit. Okay, now let's see, 45 degrees. The ear canal is here. The ear canal, this one, this is the vertical ear canal. Huh? 45 degrees and not too close. Too close, you can't. Uh, there's no space for the wet to come out. Okay. You need a 20cc syringe so that there's more pressure. See? If you use a 5cc or 2cc, there's not much pressure. Some ear wax came up there. Okay. The best is a bit pressure. Now the dog is going to wake up soon. There is a bit of dirt here and there. This could cause irritation. Now I should use the cotton box. To check uh, any bleeding. See very clean, some blood, some some brown wax at the side, but not much. So that should be okay. Then I will do the other side. The other side actually we don't need to do because there's no complaint. So I will, I will do 
more on the on the left left ear. The left ear is the one with the complain actually. So like one more time. The middle ear. Normally the dirt is in the middle ear, which is hard to assess. You can see this one here. Now the owner didn't put any oil or self treatment, so it's easier in this case. Okay, normally 10 strangers will do. Okay, so I'll do a quick one on the other side. Come over this side. Okay, stop already, you can stop it. So